I'm transforming into Kourtney Kardashian. So I get told, I've gotten told like three times, um, or maybe four. One of the persons, people, insisted that I look like her. And I don't see the resemblance. I don't. I don't think I look like Kourtney Kardashian, but she is very pretty, so I think people are just trying to be nice to me and compliment me sometimes. I've gotten told that before, so I was like, okay. I've been wanting to like do this video for a while. I just never did it until now. And so I'm going to be following her Vogue like video that she did with Vogue. I just said that, okay. And you know, I got the whole black robe just like her, you know. I'm gonna just follow along. I've seen this video before and um, yeah, I'm gonna just. Kourtney Kardashian's guide to natural-ish makeup. Oh, ma naturalish masking and makeup. Hi, it's Kourtney Kardashian. First. Hi, it's Kourtney Kardashian. I can't talk like her. Hi, it's Kourtney Kardashian. Hi, it's Kourtney Kardashian. Hi, it's Kourtney Kardashian. Okay, I can't do it. So today we're doing a purifying mask, and this one is Root Science Facial Mask, and you mix it yourself. Okay, so I do not have Root Science facial mask, but I do have a purifying mask, kind of. I use the Glam Glow Super Mud Clearing Treatment <laughs> mask, and I usually just put it on the places where I have pimples. But since she puts her mask all over her face, I'm going to do the same thing. So she just, hello, thank you. She just puts it all over her face and I'm gonna do the same thing and put it all over my face and like I love this mask it really does clean out my pimples um, and it lasts me a long time like I get the small little ones like when you're like in line to check out at Sephora and I don't need the big one and I don't need to pay for the big one if I'm just gonna usually not do this I never I just put it on my pimples but you know Courtney she puts it all over her face. I don't know why people tell me that I, well, I've had, I guess it's more, I don't know. I'm confused. Like I don't ever see the resemblance. I have seen it in one picture and if I find the picture, I'll post it and you know, I'll show, not post it. I'll show you like the one picture that I think, okay, maybe she could be my distant relative <laughs> but nothing more nothing less so now i'm just gonna wait for this to dry because i don't know if hers ever dries down it's not really clear in the video but this one has to dry down and turn into like a light gray color so just gonna go on my phone Oh, she makes a little scrub. Of honey in the coconut oil. Uh, okay, well, I'm gonna make my lip scrub equal parts of Fenty and equal parts of Beauty and scrub the lips. Hold on. I need lip balm. Okay, she doesn't put on lip balm, but I need it because I can't stand my lips feeling any kind of dry, so hold on. I'm sorry, Kourtney Kardashian, this is not a part of your routine tutorial, but I need this. I need this. While I'm sitting here, I'm gonna drink my avocado smoothie. So now I'm gonna wash the... Did I have... No, I don't even... I like avocado, I love avocado. But I don't want it in a smoothie. That sounds kind of nasty, to be honest. Fresh pads from my dermatologist, Christy Kid that are just pretty um, natural. They have tea tree oil and witch hazel. Okay, since I don't have a dermatologist that has little facial pads with witch hazel and tea tree oil, but I have this tea tree and witch hazel spray thingy and cotton pads. So really, I can just DIY it, which is what I'm gonna do right now. 
Okay, that was probably wasting out a lot. Good thing this isn't really that expensive, but still. Keep my skin in check. Okay, this keeps my skin in check. Poosh. Bible. This really Bible keeps my skin in check. Uh. Sturm Hyaluronic Serum is one of my Hyaluronic Serum. Okay, so she goes in with the serum. So do I. It is not Hyaluronic. It is the Biosense Squalene Squalene uh, Serum thing. And hers is an oil, but I don't have an oil serum. This is all I have as far as serums go. So it smells good though. And then when I was drinking celery juice, hold on. My whole body felt dehydrated. My whole body felt dehydrated. <laughs> I will put this um, Caudalie Beauty Elixir. That's how you pronounce it. Okay, cool. Caudalie. I would say Caudale. This is a Caudalie. It's not the same one. Hers it looks like not as pink. Like the bottle doesn't look the same. But it is a Caudalie. Um, elixir spray thing. Okay, that's enough. This stuff is expensive. Put a little oil. It also gives a little glow under your makeup. Face oil. This is also the Biosense Squalene, Squalene Vitamin C Rose Oil. And she just like pats hers on, which I never do actually. I always rub it. Like, I rub down, like, like this. So I guess I'm just gonna pat it today. Cause that's what Kourtney Kardashian does. Cause I'm Kourtney. Every day I put on sunscreen. Okay, I would put out sunscreen if I was gonna go out, but I'm not going out. So, no sunscreen for me. Doing my skincare is like a moment of the day that I have to myself. <laughs> Poosh. It's this foundation that I love, it's Oxygenetics and it's healthy for your skin. And I mix two colors, honey and almond. Okay, well, I don't have Oxygenetics foundation because I don't even know where you get Oxygenetics foundation, but I have Pat McGrath, and it's one that's like pretty lightweight. Like you can build it up, but light layers, I guess. It's not thick at all, but she applies it with her hands. She just like literally rubs it in. I never do this. Oh my God, this feels not good. I never do this. Never would do it ever. Ugh, could you, ugh. Could you, oh. Could you imagine like doing this every day? I'm sorry, but a beauty blender is where it's at for me. Well, now my hands are like covered in foundation. Um, she put Makeup Forever Concealer. Don't have it, don't know it, but I have Too Faced, Born This Way. She uses one of those little mini, like, micro beauty bl blenders. Okay, powder foundation. What? Okay, she takes powder foundation. I do have one, but I don't feel like going and getting it, so I'm just going to take my loose powder. <laughs> Why did I say it like that? Loose powder. I'm just going to take it and tap some out and do the same thing. So since she doesn't wear blush, we just go straight into the bronzer. And she just bronzes her face. Miss, I was about to call her Kimberly. That is not Kim. Um, Miss Courtney uses her bronzer to contour her nose and her eyes and everywhere else. I don't ever contour my nose. I don't know how to contour my nose. Um, 
so I don't do that. So I'm just gonna skip that step just to avoid looking like I have dirt on my nose. Then she does the dumbest thing ever. No offense, Courtney, but then she takes Kim's little cream contour and then she contours her face. Wait, let me see how she does this though. Cause she already put powder on. Like my what? nose, my eyelids, and bronze my face. And this is Kim's. Um, She's looking a lot more shinier than I am though. Like I'm definitely, I probably put too much powder. But I'm really oily, so if I don't, then like contour. And instead of drawing the lines on my face, I like to keep it a little more natural. So I put it on my hand. I take a brush. This is if just, I don't do this every time I do my makeup. This is like a once in a while if you just want a little extra. Oh Literally the most extra thing ever. First of all, you don't even get that much in here. Yeah, I've had it for like a little bit, but I haven't used it that much. Like there wasn't that much to begin with. <laughs> um, and then she like puts a whole bunch on the back of her hand. <sighs> and then takes a brush, contours her face. I guess. I don't really have to contour my forehead. I don't know why I went for the forehead. As if I had to. My forehead is tiny enough. Okay, we need more. I definitely didn't put enough. She contours her face. Okay, I... Okay. Okay, I don't know what it is. But that looks good. Like... Snatched. That looks very snatched. It's weird though because I'm putting a cream on top of a powder. But I kind of like how it looks on my cheeks right here. She really might have just sold me on something here. Concealer. We already concealed and put powder. Okay. Girly. I'll put a little bit more concealer because that's what you do. But she puts it on her like you know blemishes but i hate i actually hate putting concealer or makeup on my blemishes because it just makes them worse literally looks so dumb because i already put powder courtney <laughs> what are you doing it probably does work for her like the products that she uses and her skin type and it all just works well but like on my skin on my face with my products, doesn't really look the same. Doesn't really work. She is now powdering with a beauty blender with loose powder. The first powder that she did, which I guess she put like little to none on her face, was like a pressed powder, like a foundation, powder foundation. So now she's just going in the oily spots, like the middle part of her face and applying powder. I'm getting powder all over me. I actually have a Lancome mascara. Hold on. So now we're to my favorite part, which is mascara. And she curls her lashes. Thank God. Um, and she... Oh, wait. Fuck. I'm an idiot. <laughs> she uses a Lancome mascara. And I was like, oh, yeah. I have a Lancome. Lancome, why can't I see it? Lancome mascara, but it's Dior. Oh well, well I'm just gonna curl my lashes and do the same thing. I gotta use this mascara anyway, so I'm just gonna continue. I don't have any other high-end mascara, this is it, so. You know, same vibe. I'm still like looking at the contour part because I see like the cooler like where the contour stick went, and that actually looks good. Wow, I was really, oof, hating on her for that, but that, I like it. Whoa, well, I kind of love this mascara right now, hold up. Cause the first time I tried it, I didn't really like it like that. But I'm kind of loving it right now. Hmm. What was I talking about that I hated this mascara? Or like, not that I hated it, but I thought it was not good. This is a Kylie lip liner. Dolce K is the color. I have Dolce K. I have it right here. 
This is RMS Magic Hour. RMS Magic Hour, I don't have her, but I have Dolce K, which is all that matters. She likes like a darker lip line and then a like nude lighter lipstick for the 90s vibes that she really likes. And she overlines her lips, as do I. I'm actually also gonna use another Kylie product. It is a Kylie lipstick in the color Butterscotch. And it's a cream lipstick. 90s vibes. Be a bit darker than the lipstick. 90s vibes. 90s vibes. So she doesn't do anything crazy. She just fills in her eyebrows. My eyebrows literally don't need to be filled anymore in. They're perfectly fine. If I fill them in more, I feel like they look too much. Like it's just too dark, too intense. Um, and she just goes along with the natural shape of her brow. So I'm gonna do the same thing, but just set my brows with brow gel. We don't have the same brow shape. Hers is really arched. Mine are pretty straight, but I'm gonna try to like push them up to make them look less straight. <laughs> she puts a little bit of luminizer, which is just highlight. Do people call it luminizer? I'm gonna do the same thing and she does it with her fingers and she puts it on the side right here, which is kind of weird, but I never really thought about doing it just right there. Cause she bought a whole fan of the highlight and contour <laughs> she's not a fan and then she goes because that's not my vibe it's not my <laughs> it's not my vibe couldn't be mine well that's it we're done i did courtney kardashian makeup and the way courtney kardashian would do at least around April 2nd, 2019. This is how she would do her makeup. And I got the robe and I got the hair. Do I look like her? No, I don't. And she's like, bye guys. Bye guys. I wish my bathroom looked even half as nice as her bathroom does. Okay, well, um, that was me doing Kourtney Kardashian makeup slash turning myself into my celebrity lookalike, which I don't, I don't think so, but do we look alike now? Like, do I look like her? Like, do I, do I look like her? I don't know why I feel like I have to, like, do this when I have, like, my hair in a bun. I just feel like this pose with my hands right here just looks better. What's the thumbnail for this? Because I kind of need to do it. So here we are. I like the contour thing. The only thing I hate is that she applies her foundation with her hands. Now, I gotta clean up my mess. Okay. Oh wait, she's like, Thank you guys for watching, and yeah, <laughs> okay.